Hi everyone, this is Business Hunters. Um, today I want to quickly respond to my proposal I made a couple of weeks ago. Um, if you could remember, I made a proposal to my audience a couple of weeks ago asking them if they are interested in learning many importation. Um, I realize a lot of people, I have a lot of new subscribers at the moment, people who just came in contact with my channel for, for the very first time and they have subscribed. Um, about 200 people just subscribed not quite long, a couple of weeks ago. Um, after I made a proposal, uh, now what I want to do in this video is to quickly begin to teach you on how you can import anything at all directly from China to Africa, wherever you are living in Africa, even if you are living in Europe. What I am going to teach in this tutorial is something that is going to give you a guideline wherever you are, you are coming from to successfully import your items from China to your country. So that is what I am going to teach in this video this morning. As you can see, I am not showing my face on this video because I am doing this video in the night and um, the light is not that bright where I am right now. So I am not going to show my face, but just follow me carefully in this video and ensure to watch this video from this beginning to the end so that you can catch every detail of information I am going to share in this video. It's going to be practical. I am going to take you online to show you step by step on how you can go about it so that you don't miss anything. That's what I'm going to basically do in this video. So if you are watching this video, you just need to keep your attention 100%. Um, I know that a lot of my followers are already people who are into who people who are into importation from China or wherever they are importing from in Turkey, India, UK or wherever they are, they are they are shipping from. So if you are if you are somebody who is already into importation, as I go along with this video, I want people, I want you guys to be asking me questions in these videos. I want you to be contributing. Whatever question that comes to your mind, just put it in the comment below so that we can make it interactive. And if you have experience, you can add to it in the comment below so that the newbies, the new people that are trying to come into this business can also learn from it. This is all I want from you. And also endeavor to subscribe to this channel. Click on the notification bell, comment on the videos, and also thumbs up for this video so that we can be active online. That is what I want you guys basically to do for me. I want you to do three things for me. If you have not subscribed yet, subscribe to my channel, like this video, share this video, and also comment on this video to share your mind. That is all I want you to do in this video. So let us go straight to the point. As you can see here, step by step tutorial, step by step re mini importation tutorial. This is the topic of this video, and I listed five items here that you're going that we are going to dwell on, but we are not going to be limited to these items. We are going to uh, broaden our our thought this month uh, this, about this particular topic. But the first item is best shipping agent, which I am going to show you in Nigeria here. Best shopping websites, knowing original products. How to get best suppliers? How your goods can can move from your suppliers to your shipping agent and to you in your country. What this means is that your goods, when you buy it to your supplier, your supplier will ship it to you. That's what this number five is talking about. So let me quickly show you. One of the shipping agents that I want you to start with, if you are just a starter, if you are a newbie, I am not going to congest, I am not going to congest your head with information. I am going to go straight so that you can capture this information. I don't want you to be confused. So I am going to streamline showing you only one shipping agent that you can use for the for this start. As time goes on, when you begin to understand the system, when you begin to learn how to ship, 
you can now broaden your mind and begin to go into other deep things that you can do to help your, your importation business, like going online, even to look for shipping agent that you can use by yourself directly from China to your country, sourcing that shipping agent on, Chine on Chinese shopping website by yourself, just the same way we shop a product. I have those videos on my website, but I don't want you to go into those ones yet. Focus on this uh, pre preliminary um, tutorial so that you can get the understanding. When you understand it perfectly and you start shipping, you, you start importing, you can now delve into deep things that can help your business better. So what I want to do now, I want to quickly show you. Um, I am going to show you one of the shipping agents in Lagos, Nigeria that is so friendly to new customers that are just starting importation. And that is the shipping agent we are going to use in this tutorial. I will show you how to use your system, how you can get your product from a Chinese shipping, a Chinese shopping website to them to ship for. Let me quickly show you the, as you can see, this is the, the shipping agent I am talking about, it is called, they do, I do not write their name here, but as I take you into the website, you are going to see the name of the shipping agent. It is actually called Chris Vick Mall. Chris Vick Mall Logistics is a, is, a, is a logistics company that has been helping e-commerce guys. He has been helping many importation over the years, and a lot of people know this particular of shipping agent so well in Lagos. It's a very popular shipping agent in Lagos, Nigeria. And what I put here is the address of their office, number four slash six, Afisman Drive, off Oduye Main Street, opposite Ikeja local government. And and uh, this address is actually in Computer Village in Ikeja. When you get to get to Computer Village, it is very, very, it's within that uh, vicinity. So this is the shipping agent we are going to use in this tutorial. Now, I want to take you online so that we begin the step right now. Stay focused as I take you online. As we go online, I am going to, I'm not going to be talking too much. What I'm going to, what I will start do, I will start doing now is to be practical. So you watch what I am doing. Because I'm not going to be talking much from now on. I'll just be chipping in one or two things. So follow me now. Let's go online. Let me quickly launch my browser. And let's go straight. So if you come to this place, you are going to type in Chris Vick Moore. It comes on the browser. And I'll just click it here. Then I will also open a tab. Then I will go to, I will type in Ali, Alibaba also. Then I will now open another tab. I will type in 1688 and load it. We are going to use these three sites. This is Krivik Mall Logistics. We are going to use it. As you can see, I'm already signed. I've already, I'm, I'm, I'm already, my browser is remembering my users. So this is just it. So you just have to be patient as you go along with this video. So the first thing that you need to do, like Alibaba website here, what you need to do is to come to Alibaba website, create an account. Everybody knows how to create account. Just like you open your Facebook account, just like you open your Instagram account, you create account, you put in your details and you create a password and you have access to a detail like this. So what I am going to do right now, 
is to show you how you can get sh um, how you can buy items on Alibaba and send it to Krivis Mall. I am going to show you on Krivis Mall where you can get their shipping address in China where you will send your items that you're buying from Alibaba or 1688 to. So that is what I'm going to show you here right now. So what you need to do here now, you create account with Alibaba. You also create account. When you search for Chris Rick Moore, create account with them. For 1688, if you are a new person and you do not know how to create account because it is actually written in Chinese language. So what you need to do is just to get to the website and source for items yourself. When you source for the items, you will copy the link of that items and you come to 1688 and you paste the link. You come to Chris Vick more rather and you paste the link then the management of Krivik Mall will help you to buy that particular item for you. When they buy it for you, you will, they will now create a shipping order for you. When they create a shipping order for you, you will now order your items from there and they ship it to you in Nigeria. I will show you how you can do that. Let us, let me quickly log into this. Uh, Okay, we are actually at on the dashboard of uh, Chris Rickmore right now. There are some details by the left hand side that you're not seeing. If you come to the left side, you will see dashboard, you see profile, you see wallet, you see procurement, you see link management. That link management is what you're seeing here. When you come to um you need to come down you see as you can see here you see utility you see crypto trading you see affiliate referral when you create account with them you have a, a link that you can send to people they sign up so they give you small um they give you small commission for referring people to their website so what I need to show you now is this. See this this um, website is still loading. You see it is written in Chinese language, but what you can do, if you want to buy anything, just right click. If you right click, you can see, you can translate this website to English. This website can be translated to English if you are using Google Chrome. In case you want to buy anything, you see the details is written in Chinese language. Right click on your computer and you will see translate to English. When you click on translate to English, it will translate every detail of this website to English. Then you can come to search bar here and search for whatever product that you want to search. Let me quickly search for um air fryer let's search for air fryer is opening a new tab to show us to give us the query that i just put in right now you just have to be patient in this video like i said earlier it's a video that is going to take a little bit longer because it is a practical video that I'm going to be showing you online how you can do this thing. So it will take time. You just have to be patient and follow carefully so that you can understand what I'm trying to do here. It is a tutorial that you need to take your time to, to understand.
So do not be in a hurry. If you are in a hurry, you are not going to learn anything here. Watch this video. Dedicate your time to this video that we are trying to make. As you can see here, this is air fryer machine that you're seeing here. And the figure that you're seeing here, 115 yuan. The 115 yuan that you're seeing here is Chinese currency that you're seeing here. So if you go to Google, you can actually type in and convert this figure to dollars and you know how much dollar this, is, this thing costs. That's what you do. If you go to Google now, you type you want to dollars. It will bring out the result. Click on it. You put in 115 yuan to dollars. It will give you equivalence in dollars. And you know how much this thing worth. That's how you do it. But let me click on the detail of this air fryer so that I show you how you are going to use it. Let's say we want to buy this air fryer from 1688.com. What you do here now, as you can see the price here, the, the more quantity you buy, the lower the, the, the price. That is the two prices that you're seeing here. You see here 115 yuan. You see here 152 yuan. The more if you buy more, you get it at this rate. If you buy small quantity, you get it at this rate. But that's not what we are talking about. So you go to your browser and copy the link of this product on the browser. You copy it. Now we go back to 1688. Put the link here. When you come here, you are going to see Link Manager. If you click on the Link Manager, you put what I just copied. Now, the link to that air fryer, and you put it here. Then you click on Fetch Info. You see? It works. Um, 1688 just does he has translated this um Chinese language into English now air fryer, fryer oven, household, blah 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 blah. Here, so what you need to do now is to open the at the top here, you can see click to view it. So when you click it here. You can see the details now. Even on 16, even on Chris Moore, because he has been translated, you can see, you can see the dollar equivalence of what we copied initially here now. It's 17.34. Then you can see 23.37 when you're buying less quantity. Then you can see the weight of this item, 4.37. Calculated by Chris Vickmore, 4.35 kg. Then what you need to do now, if you want to buy these particular items, you either add it to cart or you add it to wish list. If you add it to wish list, it means that you're not going to buy it. You are just adding it to get back to it next time. So let's add it to cart here. How many he has liters by lead? This one is 2.8 liters, this one is 4.5 liters, and so on. So, if it is okay, even on the liters, the price differs here. You can see if it is 2.8 liters that you want to buy, you can just how many quantities are you buying? Let's say you want to buy one, you're buying 2.8 liters of this uh, air fryer, then you add it to cart.
your items has been added to cart. So let us view the cart. You can see that on my cart, I have two items here. I have added one of these things initially, but let me remove this one so that we can use only one. Okay, one has been removed. So let me calculate the cost of these items for you to see. Okay, could not calculate. I think there is a network issue. Say, calculation cannot be completed at the moment due to the following reason error code. So, but if you want to, when it's time for you to buy this thing, since you have already added it to the cart, you will now go and place order for these items. But because we are not buying it now, I'm not going to place order. But the most important thing is that. You are able to go to 1688 and get your product to um, Chris Vickmore, added it to their website. So you will now require them to buy it for you. When you place order for, for buy, they will buy this item for you. You pay them in Naira into their Nigerian uh, bank account. Then you go and upload, you go and upload the picture on their website. Or you call somebody to tell the person in their office that, hey, I just paid for so so and so. They will now help you buy this item for you. They will help you buy this item for you. When they buy this item for you, they will now come to their website and create an order for you. When that order is created on their website, you will now come and place order for shipping. They will now ship this item to you directly in your country. That's what you do. That is it for Chris Vickmore. You go to the, uh, you, that is it for 1688. You go to 1688 platform. You get a product that you want to buy. You copy the link. You come down to Chris Vickmore and you submit it on their website. They will help you to buy it for you. Then, when they buy this product for you, they will also create a shipping order on this same platform. Then you pay for the shipping, whatever amount they calculate for you, you pay for it. They now ship it to you in Nigeria. When they ship it to you, if you are living outside the Lagos, they will propose whether you they can still do another local shipping within Nigeria to you in your state, or you go to the office in Lagos. But I always advise my audience. If you are shipping, if you are living outside of Lagos, what you need to do is to get somebody, a family member that you know in Lagos here, yeah, to go to their office, pick it up, go to the park, car park, and send it to you in your state. Because if you want to ask Krivik more to send this item to you within the country here, the cost is going to be too much. And when you are buying at a high cost, you will find it very difficult to make profit from it. So that is my advice for my audience. Get a family member that lives in Lagos to pick it up for you in Ikeja and send it to your state. As simple as that. So now, we want to talk about how you can get your product from Alibaba and send it to Chris Vickmore to ship for you. Now, let us search for air fryer here on Alibaba now. While it is still loading, we just need to we need to quickly go for other things. I'm 
my internet network is kind of very slow at this point. Okay, let us click on one of these stuff and open it up. On, on Alibaba, Alibaba, when you want to buy anything on this platform, what you need to do is to chat with the supplier of these items. This one, I am advising that you buy this thing by yourself using your master credit card. Unlike, unlike um, Chris Vick Moore, that somebody has to buy for you. That is why. I prefer most time people always say that uh, items on um, sixteen eighty eight are cheaper than um, Ali Alibaba. But by the time somebody buys it for you and ship it for you, it becomes more expensive. But what I do myself, I buy more on Alibaba because when you are buying yourself using your credit card to pay the supplier yourself you end up paying less because the rate at which you will be charged is bank rate so the rate they will charge you is lower than what you will get from a third party that will buy for you so that is why i prefer this particular website alibaba so we are in the detail as you can see, we are in the detail of this product. So if you look at this point here, you can see chat now here. You can see chat now. If you are already signing into Alibaba, you can click on this chat now. You can click on this chat now and begin to chat with this supplier what you're going to ask a supplier is you're going to ask the supplier if he has this particular product in stock if he says yes he has it then you will now tell him hey i want so so pieces of this item or i want one piece just for a sample for me to test the quality i always advise that before you buy anything is in quantity please first of all buy a sample first don't be in a hurry. When you import only one, bring it down and test it to see if it is quality. If it is quality, then you can now go back and invest more money into it. That is the way you can buy quality product. But if you just see a product and it is good to look upon, and you pour in millions of naira or thousands of naira to purchase these items in bulk, if you bring it down, if it is not quality enough, you will now lose your money, which is not good enough. Look at this um, five star that you're seeing here. Look at this review. Somebody has one one person has given a review about this particular product, and six people has bought it. Look at the reviews that people are giving about a particular product for you to figure out the original. Like I said in one of my videos, sometimes when you look at the reviews. You could be deceived by reviews also. If you see that a particular country, let's say a U.S. company, a, a U, a USA, everybody that is giving review about this product is from U.S., you have to suspect this kind of a review when a particular country is the one giving review about a product. It simply means that some people have been hired to, to give fake reviews just to boost their sales. But if you see a review that Different countries entirely all over the world are giving reviews about a product. You know that that product is genuine. Like you can see this one now. It's only one person that gave a review here about this product. So watch out for reviews, what people are saying about the product, and how many people have bought it. Okay, you can see that this thing is launched now. The chart now that I just clicked, not, not quite long. It didn't come up immediately because my network was slow. But now it is up now. So what we need to do now to chat with the seller of this air fryer, you begin to chat here. 
Hey. His name is Hans. Hey, Hans. Do you have this air fryer in stock? Then you send a message to him. Even if he's not online, leave a message there. He will respond to you when he's up, when he, when he comes online. I want one piece sample to test the quality before I place bulk order. Then you also leave him there. If he comes back later and confirm to you that yes, he has it, you will now come, you can see, this one already has start order. Then what you need to do now, when he agrees that he has it and you want to buy only one and you agree on the price, well, the moment you agree on the pricing with him, remember that he's going to add shipping fee within China to it. Sometimes it may be $1 or $2 to this figure just for their local shipping within China to your shipping agent. So what you need to do now, you now come to Chris Vickmore on your dashboard. When you see your profile, if you click on your profile now, you see a drop down. Then if you click on this drop down, you will see my Chinese address. Click on it. As you can see, this is the, 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 the Chinese address of Chris Vickmore Logistics, the English language version and the Chinese language version. What you need to do is to copy the Chinese, since you are chatting with a Chinese man, copy the Chinese um, address and go back to this man here. I am not buying this product, but I'm just showing you what you can do, your conversation with this man. So I am back here. Now what I will do now is this is my shipping agent address. Kindly ship to this address and send. Then also give him a direction. The username you use on Chris Vickmore, give it to that person. Like for my, my own, let me let me use it. My user address is my username rather. My username, my username is GPM. My phone number, just give him your username on Chris Vickmore. Give him your phone number. Tell him to write your phone number on the package. Tell him also to write your username on the package. So that when he gets to Chris Vickmore Logistics office in China, they will know exactly who is sending. You know that they are not buying this item for you. You are the one that is buying it directly on Alibaba by yourself. What you are doing is sending it to, um, you are sending these items to Chris Vickmore from Alibaba. So you are buying it yourself, sending it to Chris Vickmore Logistics address in China. What they will use to, to, to distinguish the packages that they are receiving is your username, which like my own GPM here. And I will also tell the, the supplier to write my phone number on the package. Then I will now give him this Chinese address that I just copied now. I will just paste this for him. 
he will now ship these items I am buying from him to this address. And the moment um, Chris Vickmore Logistics receives it, they will now come back to their website and update it there. So whenever you come here, you are going to see your order. You are going to see what you have placed order for. So when you see it, what you do is to go and place shipping order. And they will now ship, they will now ask you to pay into their bank account, Nigerian bank account you pay. They will now ship it to you in Nigeria. That is basically how you start importation with um, Alibaba and 1688. If you look at 1688, is a is a little bit of complication because it's purely Chinese language. But you can still create an account too. if you have a fast internet connection. I am not going into that detail because you can see how my network is very slow this time. So if I'm in the office and I have a better internet connection, I can do all that. But you can see now. If you translate this website, let me try if if I can translate it now. If it is tra if if you translate it to English, uh, hey, you can see now. This website has been it has been translated into English now, as you can see. So you can also create you can also create an account here. And buy things directly yourself on this platform also. But I prefer using Alibaba because it's seriously straightforward. I don't need to stress myself and all that. So that is what you need to do. Copy this address, give it to your supplier in China. Like I just showed you not quite long this year. You submit it to the supplier here. Let me even submit it. So when I pay for this item, this is where the supplier is going to send my product to. The moment the product gets here, Krivikma will see that, okay, the person that bought this product is GPM. You can see my name here, even on the address. Look at it, GPM. So when they see it, they will go to my platform and update that, hey, so so person that bought so so items. The weight of this item is so so and so. And this is how much it costs to ship it. Click on the shipping order and pay money. You pay money into their account and you come and they will now come and credit your wallet. They will come and credit your wallet. In, in, let me show you. Let me come to my dashboard and show you what I'm talking about. When you pay money into when you pay money into Chris Vickmore, um, when you pay money into Chris Vickmore local bank account, and you inform them and they see it, they will come and credit your account. Look at my balance here. I have only zero point zero three dollars here. So they will credit your account here. When, the moment you have credit on your account here, you can place order for whatever items that you want to ship from here. As simple as that. And look at it, this is how much they are charging per kg. They will charge 540 Naira per, per dollar rather. One dollar according to their shipping uh, charge. They will charge you five dollars or 540 dollars, uh, 540 Naira rather per dollar. This is how they they're going to charge you. But as you begin to learn this thing, as you begin to learn this thing, you are going to learn how to ship, how to go to, come to Alibaba like this. I have it in my other videos. If you go to my platform now, go to my channel and you see that video there, how you can ship, how you can source shipping agent. Let me just show you a little here. Let me come here and say shipping agent to Nigeria.
So guys, if you have anything that you want to any question, please put it in the comment. I think as you're watching this video, you must have a question. If you have a question, put it in the comment. Put it in the comment. And as I always say, I respond to all comments. If you put a question, a lot of people have been contacting me and I always I always respond to their questions. Put a question in the comment, like this video and share this video, comment on this video, subscribe to this channel. So that's what I want you to do for me. I will answer your qu I want to answer your questions. Put it in the comment, please, if you have any one. So as you can see, you see all kinds of shipping to Nigeria here. Say you can see this one now. So what you need to do is to click on the detail and chat with this person. You just you, you just saw how I was chatting with that Chinese agent. Even if they are not online, just leave a chat. When they come online and see it, they will respond to you. So chat with this person and tell this person, hey, this is how much this I want to ship 10 kg, 15 kg. Please send me your Chinese. If you have to agree on the price first, the shipping cost first. When you agree on the shipping cost and you see that it's favorable to you, tell the person to send their Chinese address to you. Just like I just, I just showed you this, um, what is it called? I just showed you this shipping, this shipping address. As you can see here, this one is for Chris Vick Mall Logistics. The shipping agent on Alibaba have the same thing like this. When you when you agree with them on the shipping cost, this is the same. They are gonna send you something like this. So when you buy your product, you send it to them. They will now package it. You use your Mastercard to pay them. They will ship it to you in Nigeria directly from Alibaba. But that's for people that have already understand the process, the, the, this system very, very well. If you are just a new start, use Krivik more so that you don't get scammed. There are other security aspects of it, which I, I taught in one of my videos. They are all there in my videos. If you watch, if you go to my channel and you search for these things, I'm telling you, you will have, you will get every step on how to do a successful or uh, mini importation from China to your country. It doesn't matter, even if you are in UK, you are in America, and you're watching this video, the same thing is applicable to your country. The same thing is applicable. You can easily ship your items yourself directly to your country instead of using a shipping agent. So I want to stop here in this video. We have shared a lot of things in this video. We have covered, I have showed you a Chris Vickmore, which represents the shipping agent. I have showed you Alibaba and 1688. We represent this best uh, shipping website. I have showed you how to know original products by watching the reviews of people. What I'm doing basically, I'm just trying to recap. I've showed you how to know the original products by looking at the reviews of what people are saying about that product and how many people have bought it, how to get the best suppliers. You have showed you, you have seen how I chatted with that supplier on Alibaba directly, how your goods can move from your suppliers to your shipping agent and to you in your country. I have showed you Chris Vickmore logistics that you can use to get your products from China to you in Nigeria. And I also doubled it as a bonus, how you can search an agent directly from Alibaba and ship your items to Nigeria. So I am going to watch the comment carefully. Whatever people are saying on the comment, whatever question they are asking, is going to trigger me to answer your questions in another video. But I need to hear your mind once again, what people are thinking, what information do you think I have left out that you think I should still touch on it in the next video so that you can have a better understanding. If you have not really understood what I have shared so far in this video, 
I can make another video to augment this information and give you a better understanding. So this is all I have in this video. Uh, thank you very much for watching to this point. Subscribe to this channel and follow me on, ch on, on my YouTube channel so that you can get a vital information that can help you. Thank you very much and God bless you.